The 2024 Queen of Hearts campaign is a fundraiser for the American Heart Association. One local young lady taking part in the campaign is Aniston Barnett. And on February 29th at the Foundation Event Facility, Aniston and Aslan Edwards with the Aslan Hope Collection will host a Queen of Hearts fashion show. And this morning we want to welcome Aniston and Aslan to daytime. Tell us all about this fun event. Good yes. morning, ladies. Good, Good morning, morning, Chris. I was saying there, said, you all are so bright and springy and I didn't get the memo this morning. <laughs> well, everyone looks better in red. They do, oh, okay. yes. I'll, I'll keep that in mind. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. But Aniston, why did you decide to, to get involved in this campaign in the first place? Well, this is the 100th year of the American Heart Association and for the next 100 years, I've just been brainstorming what I want to bring into the new generations. Right. And I think it's really important for younger people to be educated on heart disease. It is the number one killer of women worldwide. Mm -hmm. And that way I can uplift my upcoming generations into being aware and spreading awareness of it. And talk to us more. I, I just barely touched on it there. Tell us more about this campaign, about the Queen of Hearts campaign. Yes, yeah, so Girls in the Tri-Cities fundraise to see how much or how, many, how much money they can raise for the American Heart Association, and it's a blind competition. And I'm a student from Tennessee High School, and I'm representing Bristol in this campaign. But it started locally uh, 60 years ago in Bristol, but it's gone nationwide, and it's now known as Teen of Impact. All mm -hmm. right. And Aslan, you're just bringing the, you're bringing the fashion to this I fashion know. show, aren't you? I feel like I'm helping the next generation. She nice. came to me, and I wanted to help in any way that I could. And we've given um, another fashion show donation to American Heart Association, so I couldn't have picked a better way to be able to support this. It's going to be a great night. And Aniston, tell us when this is all happening. I know yes. I, I, like I touched on it briefly, though, but this is going to be a nice event. Yeah. It's going to be so much fun. Well, we are under one week away. It's okay. this upcoming Thursday, right. February 29th from 6 to 8 30 p.m. at the Foundation Event Facility in Bristol, Tennessee. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And Aslan, what can folks expect? I'm so excited. So we're going to see some bright colors on the runway. Okay. It's going to be fun, bright, colorful, um, and we're also going to be able to sell to all of our, all of our Bristol women. So we're going to have a marketplace there so you can shop with us and the other Storybook Looks is going to be there with children's clothing and we're going to be there with women's clothing. So we're so excited that you can shop and see everything on the runway. Nice. Yeah. One, one stop shop. Yeah. It'll, it's going to be shot. fun. Yes. It, you mentioned it briefly there, but it's so vitally important to help out your the next the generations coming behind. It is, and I feel like you know we're all busy, but this is a night that you'll want to come out and support. And we are two small business women trying to you know make a great night. So we really hope that everyone can come out um, next Thursday. Right. Yeah. Aniston, you have some folks that are helping you out sponsoring yes. this event. Talk to me about this. So our main sponsors are Ballad Health, UPM Pharmaceuticals, and Blue Emu. And I'm so excited to have Ballad Health bringing one of their team members to speak on heart disease at the event. Okay. So it's a really good place for exposure and learning about the different signs and symptoms. And aside from that, all of the Tri-Cities community has been very helpful with getting everything together. Yeah. And I know everybody's looking forward to the fashion, but there's so much more going on yes. at this event. Tell us about that. So we have a silent auction with some really cool baskets. We have over 20 baskets right now for you to auction for. And it's going to be some really cool prizes. And then, of course, like Asin said, we have the marketplace where we're selling items. There are eight pop-ups right now. So okay. there's a lot to choose from. It'll be a really fun night. Yeah. Uh, well, it's going to be huge. It's going to be huge. Yeah. It's going to yes. be fun. It's going to be fun. Thank you all for stopping by. Thank you. Thank you for what you're doing. Yeah. All right. The American Heart Association is the, the big winner here, really. It is the Queen of Hearts Fashion Show. It's happening next Thursday, February the 29th. They're at the Foundation Event Facility in Bristol. Scan that QR code right there on the screen if you got your you got your cell phone handy because that'll get you.